Well, the University of Evansville baseball team just wrapped up its regular season over the weekend, claiming first place in the Missouri Valley Conference. The Ace is now competing in the conference tournament, and ever since those first practices at the beginning of the school year, the players have welcomed a young fan along for the ride. Aaron Meyer shows us how the special fan and the Purple Aces are making their hometown proud. J.J. Bland is about to turn 12, but lately he's been hanging out with a much older crowd. What do you think about that dub today? The University of Evansville baseball team. Baseball favorite sport. Pretty much, yeah. The bond they share goes deeper than the game. It's an escape from J.J.'s constant fight. It aches every once in a while. Against cancer. Some days are worse than others. About two years ago, J.J.'s left leg started hurting. Mom Dana thought maybe it was a pulled muscle. JJ was a senior second degree black belt in Taekwondo, but an x-ray proved her very wrong. That's when we found the tumor in his bone. Ewing sarcoma. The tumor was half a foot long. There was surgery and chemo. I watch like some people do things and I know I can't. It just makes me kind of upset. Here though, JJ's worries fade away. He's part of Team Impact, a nonprofit that matches kids who have life threatening or chronic illnesses with college sports teams. In August, JJ became a Purple Ace. I wrote JJ on top of my practice hat just so I know when practice is getting grueling or, you know, it's getting a little harder, coach is pushing us. So, you know, I have that to see and kind of remind me what he's going through. And his is real life, mine's just a game. It's just got to put things in perspective. And he's, I think he's done a good job helping our team do that. All season, seniors Jake Mahon and James Kohler knew they'd find JJ watching right above the Aces dugout. But about a month ago, he got a very different view of the ballpark. And joining out the first pitch today, JJ and Philip. JJ threw a perfect strike. Still not as good as I'd like it to be, though. But if you ask his mom, this whole experience is a home run. They truly, truly care. They may not know it, um, but they have given him more than I could, um, more than I ever imagined. I just want him to know that uh, he's really pushed us in a different way than you can ex can explain. It's not a game thing. It's not a baseball thing. It's kind of somewhere deep, deep down in your heart. You can push yourself through anything. Final score, Evansville 12, Illinois State 5. The Aces won a lot this year. What the scoreboard can't show, though, last time and the best time, yes. are moments All you, JJ. like All these. You, Aces on three. One, two, three. Aces! Aces. <laughs> <laughs> The Aces couldn't pull it off today. They ended up losing in the first game of the MVC tourney, but they'll play again tomorrow, bright and early, and JJ plans to road trip to Terre Haute to be there. Now, if you'd like to learn more about Team Impact, the organization that made this friendship with the Aces possible, we've posted information on our website, 14news.com. Back to you.